Okay. Jefferson is dead now. All this expensive gear just for sick bullshit. Just looking at that makes me want to vomit. Makes you killed vomit. my Chloe. Damn. Jefferson torched everything. Now the only photo I can get is the one. Oh, I hate looking at me like that. Oh, that's Victoria's bracelet. Why can't I just wake up? I bet I Jefferson was going up. to use that to frame Nathan. I can't believe Jefferson is dead. Oh, I want to take that out. Jefferson. Oh, I. I. You sh. He what? I wasn't. And Mac. Me too. Uh, Jeff. That pervert. No. We all. We. There's only one option I'm changing. Uh, I tried to. I'm. I should. I'm go. I tried. And you. S I just want. David, um. Well, she was pretty stressed out, so, um, she went to go, um, medicate before I ended up in here. So, she's okay. Oh, thank God. For once, I'm happy Chloe's a stoner. <laughs> David, I, I have to go outside and get some real air and use my phone. Of course. Go on, Max. You're a brave soldier. I'm glad Chloe has a best friend like you. Go on now. Because you're my best. You've seen enough of this room. <laughs> I have no friends. Okay, teacher. Let's see what kind of photo I'm glad that freak is tied up, but I don't feel like I'm in shock. No oh, more fucking guns. How could anybody so gross? I wonder if he charged that duct tape to Blackwell. Frank isn't a bad person, but he can't be in denial about the drugs he provided. Chloe, God damn you. I'm gonna save you for the last time. There's no way I'm leaving your necklace here. Put it on, damn it. How could you? How? Looks like Jefferson was planning a major security renovation. Nobody will look at Jefferson's work the same. You're fucked, Jefferson. Time to finish the game. Freedom. Holy shit. This storm is real. So is the hype. Find me, right? Yes. Warren. Can you hear me? Never mind. Listen, do you have that photo you took last night in the parking lot? Yeah, but why? It wasn't that great a shot. Yes, it is, and I, I want it. Where are you? I'm at the Two Whales Diner. Pretty much trapped in here with Joyce thanks to this Armageddon weather. I'm expecting the ocean to turn red. I'm on my way. Come on, oh, whales crazy. are going to rip apart. You can barely walk on the sidewalk outside. Seriously, Max, stay wherever you are. I don't think the storm is getting smaller. I'm kind of scared. That's okay. 
Me too. But it's not over yet, Warren. So hold on. Whose jacket is that? Okay. Jefferson uh. is dead now. All this expensive gear just for sick bullshit. Just looking at that makes me want to vomit. Makes you killed my sure. Chloe. Damn. Jefferson torched everything. Now the only photo I can get is the one. Oh, I hate looking at me like that. Oh. That's Victoria's bracelet. Why can't I just wake up? I bet Jefferson was going to use that to frame Nathan. I can't believe Jefferson is dead. Oh, I want to do the other one. Jefferson. Oh, I. I. You should. He was. I wasn't. And Mac. Me too. Uh, Je it's a dash. That pervert. No. We all. We. There's only one option I'm changing. Uh, I tried to. I'm. I should. I'm go. I tried. And you. S I just want. David, um. Well, she was pretty stressed out, so, um, she went to go, um, medicate before I ended up in here. So, she's okay. Oh, thank God. For once I'm happy, Chloe's a stoner. <laughs> David, I, I have to go outside and get some real air. And use my phone. Of course. Go on, man. Faster, but no. Apparently, it's a storm. I can't run. Help me with that, Max. I, I can't think about all those children out there.
This makes me so sad. Arcadia Bay, yay. If we can make it out of this, Chloe. Don't fail me, Fusebox. Oh, fuck. He's dead. Electrocuted. I want to help that fisherman, but he's in shock and he might not hear me. to get out of here right now. I had to kill you twice. Uh, I need air. No more storms. You should get out of here. The whole town is dying. Okay. I better hurry to the diner over there. I need uh -huh. Roman's photo. need to go there now. Wait, there's a fire heading this way. I need to do something about it first.
the monsters are actually the people here. I wish life was back to simple X and pink. Damn, this is blocked off. Now I have to find another way into the... Look at that. This tornado might be the end of the world. But not if I can change it. her name. So selfish. Once again, this is not a test. This is not a test. At least nobody's going to starve in here. For Acadia Bay and surrounding counties. The emergency broadcast system is now in effect. Go get him, Julia. Max! Oh, Max. Oh, Jesus, I am so glad to see you, sweetie. Are you okay? Yes. What about you guys? The two whales is barely standing now. I don't know if it's gonna make it through this tornado. Oh, poor Officer Barry and all those people out oh, no. there. Okay, get your ass inside. I have to get back to this gentleman on the ground. Lauren has been gathering all the first aid. It's not much, Joyce, but it's all we have. You okay, Warren? How the hell did I ignore all those warnings, Max? The snow? The eclipse? There's nothing you could do about it, Warren. I'm so stupid. Should have seen it coming. Yeah, because you can protect the future, unlike, unlike some people. So yeah. glad everybody is safe here. It's good to have Frank on. Okay, Max. Excuse me while I go help this other gentleman. Frank, I'm so glad you're here. Yeah, it makes two of us. Now, if only I had Rachel back. Now, Max, what about that info I gave you? Did you and Chloe find out what happened to her? Oh, Frank. I don't know how to say this, so I just will. Rachel is dead. No, please. Please, no, no, not Rachel. She can't fucking be. Are you, are, you, are you sure? I mean, how do you know? We used the names you gave us to track down a farmhouse. My professor, Mark Jefferson, has this creepy photo torture room. And we found out he was using Nathan Prescott to drug and photograph Blackwell students. Prescott? Fuck! Fuck, I knew it! I should never have hooked up with that sick punk. Pompidou hated him. Yeah, you saw, you saw Rachel. Yes, I wish I didn't. I'm so, so sorry, Frank. I'm bringing him closer. Nathan wanted to impress Jefferson and he, he killed her. How? Hmm. How did he kill her? He used some drug and gave her an overdose. An overdose? The only way Nathan could have done that is, is if I sold it to him. I killed my lioness. No, what have I done? Where is this motherfucker Jefferson? He's going to jail. He won't be hurting anybody anymore. Rachel, oh God. She was the one good thing in my life, Max. I know she was too young. I expect her to leave me, just... It's not how it happened. I would never have stopped her from going after her dreams. I know. She obviously cared about you, Frank. Well, Rachel cared about a lot of people. Especially Chloe. But, uh... Now I see why Rachel dug her. And Chloe was man enough to ask me for help after all that shit we went through. Chloe would appreciate that. You know, the one time I met my dad, the bastard quoted the Bible and said he wanted to enter his house justified. In other words, to do the right thing. Me too. 
And maybe you're helping me get there, Max. Don't get me wrong, kid. I still think you're weird. But you're cool. Come on, Joyce. Focus on the people here. I hate to say I'm glad to see you. But I'm so glad to see you. That's okay. The important thing is that you're safe. And I know you can take care of yourself after Nathan. Should have done that a long time ago. But damn, Max. Can't believe you actually drove down here in the middle of a fucking E6 tornado. Just for one photograph? I mean, I know you didn't come for me. Warren, I came for all of you. And just tell me you do have the photograph. I just want... Now shut up and listen. Oh, yeah. You're finally going to tell me what you never did in the parking lot. I wish I would have. So I'm just going to tell you without any explanation. Trust me, okay? I always do. You should probably tell me quick. I had a vision in Jefferson's class of a tornado destroying Arcadia Bay. I went to the bathroom and saw my best friend Chloe get shot by Nathan Prescott. You with me so far? Where else could I be? Go on. Then I found out that I could rewind time. And long story short, Mark Jefferson is insane and dangerous. Whoa! Is that all? I have to go back in time. Jefferson already k killed Chloe. I can't let that happen. I have to do something, Warren. Why is it? Max, going back Her in time is moving. what caused the storm. Oh, because... because of me? How? I'm not a real scientist, even though I play one at school, but this seems like pure cause and effect. Maybe chaos theory. Uh, what happened with Jefferson? Did... did he hurt you? He used Nathan to get drugs and money for him. Jefferson tied me up. Why isn't her mouth moving? Dosed me with some drug and took sick photos of me. It was so horrible. Max, I'm so sorry you had to go through all that. She could be a vigilant person. The bravest person I've ever known. You know? And the best I want to kill that son of a bitch. Where is he? Busted. History. Which I need to change fast to make it right again. Is that bad? For every action, there's... there's a reaction. Whenever you reverse or... or alter time, maybe you cause a chain reaction. Even in the environment. You're my friend, Warren. You believe me, right? I... I haven't told anybody else except for Chloe and... And she can't help me right now. I know I can be a pain in the ass, and and you've always treated me like a person, not not a beta nerd. I I told you before that I'll always believe you. I just wish I could trust my powers. I guess we'll never know if it's magic or science. Even if it's from a wizard or a wormhole, you're part of something bigger. And I don't believe in fate or destiny, but after this week, I realize I don't know shit. That makes both of us, Warren. I do know you're here for a reason. And I guess it's up to you to find out why. Max, I'm sorry you got stuck in this. In this, I don't have a fucking clue what's going on. But I have total faith that you'll do the right thing when the time comes. I'm so proud of you, Max. How could there be a more important moment in history? And I'm in the middle of it with you? So thank you for trusting me. Thanks for being here. Always. Hey. Be careful out there. Do it. For luck. Just in case we don't get out of this, I wanted to say... I know, Warren. Of course you do. You can rewind. 
one time. I'm going to make the right choices from now on. I swear. That's why you're super max. No time for this shit. Come on, Max. Ugh. Chloe. Jesus, dude, what is up with you? I'm just glad we're here together. I guess you need to talk. No worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right now. He's gonna sorry, we were connected to Rachel. Let's go now. Chloe, wait. Listen. I can walk and listen. Okay. Stop and listen for once. Fine, Max. I'm listening. Chloe, you can't go in that party. You're going to... You're going to die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's no way that punk-ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me down. You're right, he won't. Mark Jefferson killed you. And others. Jefferson, the art teacher? That's bullshit! Nathan is the fucking serial killer! We saw the proof! Now, excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Nathan is dead, and you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? How do you know that? Because I was there. Will you please tell me exactly what happened? Please. Jefferson kidnapped Rachel and some other girls. He was also manipulating Nathan, and he killed him. Then it's Jefferson's turn to die now. I understand why you don't want to do this, and I won't blame you for not coming with me. Chloe! Man, she just won't listen. I better rewind. Excuse me, I'm... Nathan... That fuck... Because, will you please? Mark Jefferson turned out to be a psychopath. Okay, Max. Let's go in there as a team and take his ass out right now. Chloe. Jefferson drugged and kidnapped me. I was tied up in his bunker. You have no idea what hell I went through to get back here. But I couldn't let you die. You brought me back here, and I can't lose you again. I won't. Um, Max, I'm, I'm so sorry. I was the one who dragged you into all this shit. Nobody, especially you, should have to go through that. I. Now we have to stop Jefferson. With one bullet. No, not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if all I'm gonna do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is gonna turn out, and I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? What do you mean, Max? What did you do? I fucked up, Chloe. I wanted to make things right, but... Everything turned out wrong. Just tell me bears Max, what the hell the are you talking about? I was able to go back in time to the last day William was alive. I stopped him from leaving, but... But you ended up in a car crash instead. You saw my dad again? You... You were completely paralyzed. And you, you were in pain. You were slowly dying, and you... You asked me to end your life. I did. For you. I, I didn't want you to suffer in any other timeline or reality. I, I, 
I, I couldn't bear the thought of you in any more pain. God, Max. That must have been... That must have been awful for you. I, I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen, and as usual, I messed everything up, and... I never want to hurt you. Ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. Do you think I would even know how to handle that situation? Birds. Nobody would. Birds. The important thing is that we're together again. You're right. That's, that's why you should come with me, so we can stay together. <laughs> and stay alive. I hear you, Max, but do you think we should let Jefferson get away with torture and murder? Of course not. <laughs> if we tell David, he'll believe us, and he can actually stop him. Right? I don't get it. Why do you trust him after you totally reamed him the other day? He's not even at our house anymore. Chloe, David saved me from Jefferson. If he didn't track down the dark room, I'd be dead right now. Max, I had no clue. I should have been the one to save you, but I'm so grateful David was there. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been through so much. I, I believe you, Max. After all, I'm still your faithful companion. Yes, you are. So listen, in a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now. Just explain that I traveled through time using the photo. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. It's crazy. Shut up and back up this time. Wait, what? Oh, Chloe! I see that the real Max is back. So, how was your time trip, dude? Shut up! Oh, you're alive! You're alive! Oh, both of us! I did so much to bring you back, Chloe. It worked, it actually worked! You're with me again. It looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And travel through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over and I hope it was worth it. But I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life after all my drama. Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. Just look at what my powers have caused in just a short time. Nobody. You're Max fucking Caulfield, Time Warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. No. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I willed it subconsciously to myself. I always wanted my life to be special. An adventure. But not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So, without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. And for whatever scientific, mystical reason that we'll obviously never figure out, we were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes, fighting for justice. I'd like to think that too. We all owe Rachel Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. You you remember, right? Well, we we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't find us. For once, I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. Then the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe at the lighthouse. Chloe, look. The storm is getting bigger now. It's coming closer. Oh, I, I can't even believe this is real. This is happening because of me. Stop it. Oh, Just stop beating yourself up, okay? 
we've both paid our dues already on it. God, look at that. Look at that monster. Who knows? This could be Rachel's revenge. Our revenge. The lighthouse is out of the way of the tornado. Come on! Chloe... I've got to go back, Grace. And I'm dead. Whoa. Alfred Hitchcock famously called film Little Pieces of Time. I I'm back in class. As he what the hell? Us. These pieces of time can frame us in our glory and our sorrow. have to listen to this Jefferson light, lecture again. Shaft, this might be the hell. Chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly this captured is messed the condition up. in black and white? Am I stuck in a time loop? Anybody? Bueller? Diane Arbus. Be calm and there you go, don't Gloria. freak out. Why Arbus? Yet. Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? What's going on? And frankly, it's bullshit. Nobody even cares? Keep that to yourself. What the absolute Seriously, though, fuck? I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Everybody's gone now. What the fuck is going Have on? Have I totally fucked up time? This doesn't make sense. Not yet, you bastard. You didn't die, Kate. You're alive. Oh, that's too creepy. I think I am in hell, Jesus Christ. Oh, that's awful. What the fuck happened? Me? Are you kidding? That's the same. Rachel didn't deserve any of this. Oh no. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I just wanted to know if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Your purity inspires me so much, and we could be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? There's no way I'm saying that. No way. What the fuck? My selfies are shit. I need to be framed by a real artist. I'm just a poser. Yes. You will be posing. Wait. For me. Why? There's so many angles <laughs> I want to expose you with to the world. I hope you don't mind needles or duct tape. This can't be real. I don't believe it. I see you, Max Caulfield. I cannot say this. I like to think of it as our dark room. What it's the only this? place I truly feel safe and protected from the storm. Of well, course, Max. Technically, that's not a lie. I can capture you over and over. You can be my model for life. And death. We are going to be so happy together in the dark. Just make sure you stay pure. I won't like it if you get dirty like Rachel or Chloe. This is weird. Very, very weird. And I'm in the dorm. What the fuck is going on?
Is she lit in her own grave? Hey, Kate. Max, why did you stop me from jumping? What kind of friend are you? You never understood me or what happened to me. Now my family will never leave me alone. And that means I'll always be alone. And this Thanks is why I do to drugs. you. Kate, that's not true. I've always been your friend. I don't think that changed. Okay. All doors lead to the same place. She was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. Rachel saved my life. So Rachel took my place. I'm glad she was there. Six months ago, she just left Arcadia without a word, without me. How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. I'm so confused. Uh, what? I'm guessing match people with their doors. Why is she so fucking tall? Just matching her up with their door. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. This isn't disturbing. <laughs> 